The legal pillar of the Trafficking in Illicit Goods program focuses on two key elements. The first is technical legal assistance, and that could deal with areas such as mutual legal assistance or extradition. And the second is the institutional development and support. That means that we can work directly with governments, key government sectors, to create forums for dialogue, and then to deal with international conventions in the area of illicit trade, and by extension, transnational organised crime and terrorism, um, that the illicit trade filters. And we can work to support these conventions and to encourage governments to ratify them. We have come to India for the first time. It's very, very exciting for us to be here to train law enforcement staff and customs and also police officers um, who deal in prosecution and the prosecutorial staff to collaborate on this issue uh, and to gain um, the experience and benefits of the experience of others uh, in this forum. It is great for the legal pillar to be able to present at this training, uh, the Trafficking in Illicit Goods Training Program in India, because we are then able to connect directly with those people who are going to benefit from the experience we have and the information we have to share. We can co connect directly with prosecution um, to encourage them to work and collaborate with their police, with the customs officers, and to build the approach from the, the first seizures of goods right through to prosecution uh, with good outcomes in court. And that's what we hope to do uh, when we talk about the legal pillar. We also have a new protocol in place on the illicit trade of uh, tobacco products. And that was only signed two weeks ago on the 12th of November 2012. That means that in two years time, countries who've ratified this convention will need to implement the provisions within it on the ground. That will include law enforcement, customs again, and prosecutors. So for us, this is a very, very great forum to be able to promote this protocol and uh, it's the first protocol that we're working with.